thank you because your pictures were awesome. We had so many great ideas from your pictures. I want to take a couple minutes and I want to show you some of your classmates' images. We saw pictures of aliens. People wanted to see aliens in the picnic park. Some people wanted to see all of the stages of a butterfly or different life cycles of different animals. See bugs, frogs, toads, slides, farms, gardens, all kinds of stuff. Some people wanted to see this huge space with all these paths, a spot to do yoga. Maybe the idea of Rainbow Rock. Rainbow Rock is awesome, right? There was an idea about a rock that would squirt people in the face. Fossils, rock formations, you want to learn about how rocks were made or how rocks are created. Some of your ideas came up over and over and over again. A lot of people wanted to see a water park. Raise your hand if you wanted to see a water park. Idea. A lot of people wanted to see something else with water, like a fountain, uh, maybe a sprinkler or a rainbow rock. Raise your hand if you if you were one of the people who wanted to see water. Okay. Again, lots of people. Raise your hand if you were someone that wanted to see a habitat, like where something lived, or something about an animal. See, this is a lot of, more than two people wanted to see. So these are the ideas we started focusing on. You know, we looked at habitats, gardens, and bugs. And this is really where we started to focus our ideas, okay? So let me show you what we did next. We did some research, and we found some really cool sculptures and some really cool gardens that we kind of wanted to bring into our picnic park space. Oh, Giant praying mantis. This was a cool idea, but it's still a little expensive, so we kept looking. Looks pretty cool, a little expensive, so we kept looking until we found this art. His name is Mr. Adrian French. Mr. Adrian French, and he actually works at COSI and is an artist. He does big bug sculptures that you can climb on. And once we started talking to him, he was really interested in helping out COSI and not donating his work, but giving us a really good price. Like, and all around the butterfly is going to be the butterfly's natural habitat. So we'll have some really beautiful plants that will attract real butterflies. Okay? So one thing that we're hoping to include in this space is a big sculpture that Adrian will design of a butterfly. And this is a little part. Well, here in this next picture, I'll show you what you do our mask for your ideas. This is the current rain garden, the park that already exists in the front. What do you think this big lighter circle is? This is the hill. Take a second and look at it. And then I want to ask you what you think. And we've got our hill. Mm -hmm. There might be a sign over there. We're still trying to figure out the sign. What's this part right here? You go for it. Yeah? Okay. Awesome. That is great news. Wait. And we have to figure out where everything can go. And we have the ants will come after we put in the picnic punches. Do mm -hmm. you always see ants at a picnic? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, they, they try. You know what they like? They like the food with the water in it. That's what they do. And in my research, did you know what I found out? The ants just suck the juice out of everything. They it says student evaluation form, picnic park project. So really what this means is we want to hear what you guys think.